seven again it is 4 30 in the afternoon on a weekday there's only one other boat here gonna be trying a bunch of different stuff like six different rods got a spinner bait a big glide free rig texas rig buzz bait frog so hopefully we can get on we're gonna be fishing for a few hours so stay tuned That fish hammered it. Yep. I pulled it over on the stick and he just absolutely hammered it. First fish today on a Texas rig. Two pounder. Fat one. Texas rig. Slaying the crappie? You slaying the crappie? Oh, I, I came after crappie. I got one of the raw turns and probably six lures on it. Ah. Uh -huh. Oh, that's nice. Not exactly what I came for. <laughs> I'll take it. Is that big? You mm -hmm. started running with it. Fighting like crazy. I haven't seen him yet. Three pounder. Look at that. <laughs> that fish is never coming unhooked. The hook went through him and the line went through him. I basically lined through him. He's not hooked. The line was just going through his mouth. Was he way up there? No. He was like at the entrance of it, like right, like halfway between like where your lure was and the tip of the trees. Second fish of the day. Pretty good one. Texas rig fish. Again, three pounder. Catfish. I'll keep it in the video. You guys heard that guy. We asked me what I was catching the fish on. He said he caught a couple channel cats. He's not targeting them, but he was catching them. And this thing has eaten my Texas rig. It ate it. You got one too? It was probably a catfish. My dad just had one steal his claws, and I've got Mr. Catfish. He's talking. This is how torn up my craw is. I mean, it's missing half of it and it's cut down the middle, but it's already pretty good. He's probably got his your claws in his stomach. Hold him up. Half a pound. Kind 
a nice one off this tree the first time we were here and have nothing since. Oh. That fish slammed it. First top water fish of the day. Only my, I think, what, fourth one of the year on the buzz bait. Last time we fished this place in two videos ago, the grass, you guys can see the grass here still, but it rained a ton, what, like three different times? Twice? So the grass is like slightly under the water. So you can throw a buzz bait in some of these spots. So that's what I'm doing instead of a frog. Tiny micro. If you know what this is, comment, but I think sick. Well, I mean, when you're looking at these public places, you'll find them. I lost a, at that exact spot last month, I lost a seven. It jumped me off halfway to the boat. Literally exactly right there. Might have been the same fish. <laughs> Is that big? He's in a tree. It's off. Okay, that makes me feel better. It was a carp. Snagging carp. I thought that was a gigantic bass. It was a carp. He wrapped me in a tree like a 12 pound bass though. There's our carp sitting on that tree, getting away my Texas rig. Makes no sense. Do a whole loop of the lake and there's only fish on this one spot, one part of the bank. I just got here. Um, right off the, um, there's like a, like, maybe a th even three pounder. Mm-hmm. Um, if you're fishing for bass. Yeah. Um, over there, like, off the dock, you just have to cast a little bit farther with the Is it bass. on a bed? Yeah, like a stump hanging out of the water. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. I just saw it, but I didn't know this smell it. Yeah. Yeah. And it went me in the tree. You need help? Yeah, and it's still on there? Yeah, let me grab my other rod. How far down is he? Around the corner? Yeah, just around that corner. Check if my rod's still 
I think I see her line. Is the fish still? Oh, I see her lure on the top. The fish is gone. I don't think. Oh. See it? I should be able to get the, the tree in with one of mine. Here, hold this. Oh, oh. it came off. Dang. Oh, thank you, dude. Yeah, just yell me if you need more help. Yeah, this is. Normally I catch grass around there. Uh huh. But I'm fishing for anything. Yeah. Okay. Yell me if you need more help with anything. Yep. Little one. No, actually that was about my one. Yeah, he was over there. You're fishing is that a Texas rig? Yep. Can I go out here and flick some? Yeah, go for it. Hopefully no mom don't get territorial. I can try, yeah. How far out do you want it? Thank you, man. Yep. Get it on my feet on the swim jig. Yeah, that was a little one. It was little. I let him go already. Maybe like three ounces, maybe like a pound. Yeah, probably a little less than a pound. I'll be able to. Oh, watch out. Don't get hooked. I'll get it for you. Mama caught one. There you go. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, just yell at me. Skirt. <laughs> well, that bass just hammered at my feet and stole my skirt. That's a better one. On the swim jig that I'm fishing as a bottom jig because I broke off my Texas rig and my skirt is missing on my swim jig. It's scuffed, but it's working. Four. 
little guy in the exact same spot. This exact spot is where I jumped off the seven pounder. That's why I'm fishing here. I'll just hurry and I'll hook them real quick. Yeah, I caught two off that dock. Two bass. Just then? Yeah, a minute ago. I couldn't get a good enough grip on the hook. You think they still might bite? There you go. I'd get them back in pretty quick. It's a nice one. I'm just gonna... Nice fish. 